Hey everyone, I'm Nitrotech. Welcome back to Hygienier. Hey, you're probably going to notice a couple things different. Uh, I have a new video card. So the graphics are going to be a lot better, a lot smoother. And this new graphics card uh, is um, NVIDIA RTX. So I'm able to use the RTX voice now, which is going to make everything sound better. So I might, you might have to turn me down while I tweak things out and whatnot. But let's get back into this because tomorrow's the big day. This is going to be released tomorrow. So with that being said, we had another update. So I wanted to, I started a new game on my stream on Mixer, if you happen to catch that one. Um, but if not, that's all right. We're just going to continue that game. I started uh, digging uh, a little bit and we got some money going and, and of course it's nighttime. Let me uh, sleep real quick. All right. And you see we're over here in the uh, beginner plot. Uh, we haven't touched that side yet. But I've, I've played around with some of this. Uh, we've got the... Got a couple bars over here. Did a little bit of fishing. We got a necklace here. We can go sell that. I got one more stair. I've actually been digging down like this. And I'm not sure, but I think we should be getting close to the bedrock, but... Let's head up there, sell this, and see if you haven't seen some of the changes here. Let's not hide that in the bushes. Let's throw that out here. If you haven't seen some of the changes, we have mining helmets now, uh, quartz for the pipes, uh, the lamp po light posts have been changed. I still would like to see these as a purchasable object. Uh, the crucibles, bigger. Uh, this is find more items in bridge pour. So that's something a little new. But if we look at the map over here, bridge pour is this town right here in the center of them. And we are this little blue dot right there. I guess it's a diamond, not a dot. But anyway, uh, that's pretty much it for over here. Oh, the grinding wheel. Uh, I mentioned in my last video. Where you have, we would have to grind the gems before we, uh, you find them as uncut. So you grind them down using the grinding wheel, and then you use them on the anvil like you did before. So we're going to take this over to here. Price is down, but it's down to 82. That's 1400 for that. Let's see what it is over here. Yeah, 487. So even though the price is down, we're going to take that money and run with it. I don't see anything different over here. I am still working on uh, some hardware upgrades. Uh, I need to, I, I'm still in the process of completely rebuilding my, my system over here. But that's quite all right. We are doing pretty well now with this. I had some issues at first because naturally I, there it goes, I overclocked it um, and it was stable in like every other game I played except Hydroneer. So I had to back it off a little bit more. I don't think there's anything here we need to purchase today. I just wanted to kind of show you guys uh, some of the changes that were made. Oh, he added on the map. You can see the stock market up there in Bastion Keep. If you haven't seen yet on someone else's stream, there's some other stuff at the other town. Let's go take a look over there real quick since I... Uh, Showed this off in my stream instead of on a video, so let me head over there and I will um, bring you guys right back. Alright, here we go. So, first off is um, 
the housing. I think that's what we called it. Yeah, housing shop. Uh, tool racks, fishing pots. Those are fun. Um, we didn't bring any money. Uh, stairs. Those are nice because now we can walk up to 45 degree angles. Like on the uh, vertical conveyors. And we can do that now too. Uh, the foundations. You can now get large wood foundations. It's a 2x2. Two two. Uh, floors, you know, for multiple. Okay. I guess you probably could put it on the ground. But... That's another thing, is if you drop something in the shop, and you haven't paid for it, you pick it up again, it just disappears. Easy way to clean it up. So walls are now 2x2. Two two. Uh, the door is a 2x2 two two frame. Uh, there's the uh, angled wall. It's still 2x2, two two, but it's a diagonal piece. We have thatched roofing. That's not part of it. Uh, but there, and then you have just the regular windows here. I think you can use it as a, well, you could use it as a, you know, 4x4 four four or 2x1 wall piece. Or you can use it as, actually, I don't know if you can or not. Let's see. Can we do that? Yeah, you can use it as a, uh, um, sunlight. Or as, pff, not sunlight, um, what the hell am I trying to think of? Sunroof type? That's more for cars, but... Anyway, moving on. We have this new uh, Goliath drill. Uh, it works like the ram drill, but it the better the pressure to it, the better the yield. The better the dirt they get out of it. Funnels, tool bag... Uh, I believe it's five. One, two, three, four, five. Yep. And you use it just like a regular span. Spanner. But as soon as you use the last one, it uh, dis the whole bag disappears. Non-refillable. Yeah. Uh, we have rudder. So if you have large pieces of dirt, it'll chop it down into smaller pieces for the har to fit in the harvester. So a lot more automation. Loving it. Uh, seen the tool racks already. Uh, he got rid of the... What are those? The, uh, the backpack system. So now we just have a magnet on a stick. And a saw to cut uh, the bars down to different sizes and scales. So you can determine exactly how much you want or how much you're going to get. So if you say, hey, I need, you know, 30 more coins, you know, you throw a couple nuggets on there and, hey, I got enough coins for that. Fancy shop. Just decorative stuff. Going to get a better bed. Uh, got a nice throne here. Uh, head statue, you can um, put a necklace on. Saves to store your bars. Trophies to mount your fish. Plinths. Pillars. Show off your gems and jewelry. And that's it for that. And then the last part is the scrapyard. So one of the things he always said was the... Uh, or everyone... Not really complained about, but said, hey, you know, I've got all this stuff lying around. You know, every time I load in, it starts flying everywhere. And he says, all right, well, we got a scrapyard now. You bring your stuff over, set it here, come up here. And, of course, there's nothing there right now. But it'll melt it down into a scrap block. You take that scrap block over to the jeweler, and you get a little bit of money for it. Come on. Get up there. I still would like to see this area, you know, this wall moved over here. So that you can drive this out of here without having to just reset it. 
because it's not fitting through this little hole between the truck and this wall. That's pretty much it for the updates. We have uh, the truck has been fixed and fixed and fixed and fixed. Um, so far it's been pretty stable. I haven't had any issues with it. I haven't played too much, but um, it's 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 been a champ so far. I haven't had to you know jump out and jump back in to reset it or things like that. It's just worked. Uh, nothing new over here, I don't think. Uh, I haven't seen anything. Geronimo! Alright. So with that, let's uh, let's keep digging and um, building our little tunnel down. I plan on, since we're kind of close to this side, we're going to come down. I'm going to kind of dig out this side over here to kind of set up a mining system. And then we're just going to have all the dirt now basically we're going to set up our setup shop on this side have a tunnel going this way and then you know just have conveyors sending dirt this way or we may do just like we did in the previous videos um, or save files where we just kind of gather some money and then just head over there uh, I would like to just kind of keep at it. Um, I just have a really basic system here. Got a shovel, pick up the dirt, drop it in there, give it some water, and clean it up. I mean, there's not much. It's kind of where we're at at the in the game, where we just kind of have to just work more and. I don't think I've got anything. That's something else that's changed is the, uh, it's been balanced a lot. Um, there's sometimes, especially here in the new claim, where you won't get anything at all. Oh. Got a little bit that time. I mean, it doesn't do much good to, I mean, I probably could set up two or three of these little buckets at a time, but I mean, it still comes down to how long it takes me to actually shovel it out. So we met, I mean, we did get 1400. We probably could go pick up a harvester. See if we can't just start getting this to where we just kind of put the dirt in it and kind of like we did uh, that, that first playthrough where I set up over here. Where we just dig the dirt out and put it on the conveyor. Let the harvester do the work. I'm trying to show you guys the uh, the uncut gems if you haven't seen them yet. It's about time to put that other uh, stair down there. Another iron. Let me uh, sleep real quick for you guys. There we go. Where's that stair right there? But yeah, tomorrow's the big day. It's uh, released on Steam. There we go. Let's nail these down. Come on. It will be released at the hefty, hefty price of uh, $10. 
Uh, but if you order it within the next week, it is at a 20% discount for the everyday low price of $8 US, of course. That one looked kind of funny. Oh yeah, I think we hit Bedrock. Yep, that's Bedrock right there. Perfect. That was the perfect amount of stairs. Now you can only order the stairs. Ooh, look at that. Huge. Turn you off. There we go. That is something that kind of irritates me too, is if you're standing... Here, I'll show you. So if you're standing on the shovel, and I'm facing down the stairs, and I pick it up, well, I guess I'm facing towards the rocks. It rotates you to face north. Which, I mean, it, I guess you can't really call it a bug because it doesn't really affect the gameplay. It's just more a nuisance. I guess it's just this good stuff down here that's got the big nuggets in it. Lots of iron, too. I gotta keep moving the bucket because if I'm standing over here and I try and click the bucket over there by the lamppost, it'll click the lamppost. See? Like if I have it right here. Or like the bucket there. Get some of that out of there. I think we need to make ourselves an iron bar with those nuggets in there. I think this will be number two. Yeah. I wanna I, I usually end up waiting until I get three bars. There we go. We'll set that in the fire. And if you didn't know, you can stack these up on each other. Uh, if you can stack them. Like playing Jenga. There you go. And they'll both cook. Give me one second. Wife just messaged me. Alright. Uh, so yeah, we can do that. I'm waiting for him to implement a fire system where if you take one of these that's red hot, put it on your wood, that block will catch fire. And you gotta come over and grab a bucket, put some water in it, come over and drop water on. It. Or drop water on the block, you know, the wood block, in order to get it to uh, stop being on fire. I can see it happening, it's just a matter of time. Ah, uh, that's been bugging me too. Drop that right in and it just... Oh yeah, we're getting some of the good stuff now. Very nice. I'm just keeping... But this isn't stuff you'd want to dig and throw. And this, this is what'll get you your money. Why is in a rock? Like Let's grab that. Set that right there. Let's 
Still haven't found a good gem to cut yet. I've cut all the, the smaller ones I found because uh, I'll probably end up just selling those. There we go. Is that order? It was just there. Man, I gotta find it. He got kicked somewhere. Did I set it? No. I see there's the little ones I've done. I've got one... I don't want to call it medium, but... Where did that thing go? I'll have to go buy another one. I do not know where it went. I know I can get this thing to fly. You can come stand next to this rock. Drop it. Boink. There it goes. Because on this, for some reason, there's... He, the character throws it instead of just drops it. See? But either way, damn it, I gotta go buy one, another one of those. I'll end up finding it eventually, I know. All right. I had one because, you know, you can see the bars I got sitting over there. Didn't fall down the hole, did it? I don't see it down there. All right, oh, there we go. Drop that one there too. Actually, I think yeah, we were gonna get uh, the gold going. We, I need that one. Physics are fun. Let's set that set that piping hot cauldron on some wood. I can find a, a decent size. There's a wall. Not decent size, but this is the uncut. This is an uncut sapphire. And all you gotta do is bring it to a grinding wheel, click on it, and you have your gem. There we go. We're going to throw that. Right there. Alright, we got some liquid gold. Wasn't it like a mac and cheese commercial or something? Liquid gold and eat like that guy you know or something. Hey look, floating iron bars. Yeah, that's not right. Uh, the developer did have a lot of uh, updates coming. Uh, he's got Two major updates planned this year. Uh, I don't remember off the top of my head exactly what they were. Oh, whoops, we didn't tell it what we wanted. There we go, one more necklace. Alright, let's go see how much this one's worth. Make sure everything's off the dirt. Oh. Don't want it accidentally falling through and having to dig for it. So let's head up there, sell this. And I really hope you guys enjoy this game, those of you that are picking it up. 
Uh, again, it's coming out uh, tomorrow slash today, depending on when I get this video uploaded. Um, Friday. We'll just say Friday. Ooh, price is up to 85. 1800. Nice. Boom, we just doubled our money. That short amount of time. Oh wait, I already had one bar. But yeah, uh, get deep as quick as you can over here. That'll get you the most money. Boom, 3300. So yeah, we'll take this over. Uh, buy some more stuff for this. Uh, I played around with, uh, you know, the fishing a little bit. Just to kind of make sure, hey, is it still working? You know, I was kind of doing some, some bug checking. And other than your first cast, I mean, that kind of looks weird, but... It works alright. Yeah, little fishies. You can catch all kinds of things here. I guess you can't say all kinds of things. You're either going to catch a fish or a boot. And speaking of which... Uh, you don't get much for the boot. You don't get much for the fish either, but... You just want to kind of a break from the monotony of that. You can come over and do some of this and still make money at the same time. Pick it up. Throw it. Nope, it's still... Must be a login thing where it's sideways. We're gonna leave them there. Five blue fish, one red fish. And a boot. Awesome. But there you go, guys. Hope you enjoy the game as much as I have. Uh, I will be continuing the series. Uh, I've just been busy and kind of fighting with my computer. It's been giving me a headache. But we're gonna we're gonna keep chugging along and uh, keep going. I did get a uh, Xbox Game Pass subscription, so we'll be playing a lot of games off the Xbox. Um, I've been doing some Subnautica, Frostpunk. Uh, I'm sorry, Frostpunk Steam, uh, Ark. Um, let me know what you guys want to see. Uh, we'll definitely throw it throw it in for you guys. And thank you very much for watching, guys. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and uh, let me know what you guys think. Thanks for watching.